You've seen thus far how select allows us to choose individual columns. Um, again, here I ha I'm selecting splat from products. I could say, just give me the, if it'll let me do it, <laughs> just uh, give me the product name. Hit a five and we see all the product names. Um, so select removes the, the columns. Uh, we can also use a where to remove certain rows. For example, let's drop a where out here. And yes, this is the order that you have to write it. Selects first, from a second, where is next. Uh, let's say where unit price. Let's look at these unit price. Um, unit price greater than, I'm going to take a wild guess. Let's do 30. Uh, I, I could put the zero zero out there, but let's just run it. Greater than 30. So here's all the products. Notice we lost a few. We don't have one, two products with product IDs one, two, three, four, five, six, or seven anymore. We have eight, nine, ten, twelve. These uh, are the ones with the unit price greater than 30, and I presume this is US dollars. It, uh, units doesn't matter, but uh, for purposes of the example, it's just 30, whatever 30 means. Um, we can get a little more complex in here. Uh, let's say unit price is greater than 30 and units in stock um, less than 10. Run it and that removed even more rows. So notice that all these rows, these products, their unit price is greater than 30 and their units in stock is uh, less than 10. Notice I used the word and instead of what you're used to in other languages with the double ampersand. Uh, SQL, the defined standard, is A and D. SQL is actually an extremely old language, at least as far as computer science is concerned. The standards go back for a few decades. Um, and they just chose to use the word A and D instead. Um, so when I give a query with a where clause to SQL Server, it literally just walks down every single row in the in the table and says where, and it does this comparison. Unit price greater than 30, yes. And units in stock less than 10, yes. And so it returned these rows. But other rows, if either one of those was false because it's an and, then those rows are eliminated or sliced horizontally out of the result set that we receive. So anyway, select allows you to cut your table vertically, whereas where cuts the table horizontally.